Good morning, guys. I promise I'm not going to make this the reoccurring theme, but this is what I do every morning. I wake up, I have my wee glass of water. It's currently, eh, what time is it? It's 5 17 in the morning. As promised, this is going to be vlog number two of the year. This is going to be a day behind the scenes showing you guys what we get up to at our events. It's our biggest event today. It's the Glasgow Village Hotel. And I'm going to be brutally honest, I'm not going to start this off negative. I'm fucking exhausted. It's been an insane week. We're on the 13th of the month. We've got a huge announcement today that you're going to see later in the vlog. And there's a lot of work that's went into this. Um, and yesterday I was actually at a huge event as well, which was all day. So we were up early and we actually picked my coach John up at the airport last night at Edinburgh Airport. So which is like fucking <laughs> the other side of the country. Scotland's on the small. We've got a banner, we've got some bars, we've got some worksheets and some stuff for the event. So yeah, it's going to be insane absolutely buzzing for it um yeah i don't really have anything much else to say apart from i'm gonna go get ready we're gonna go get a walk in because yesterday i think i hit six key steps i've done some push-ups and air squats in the morning so yeah this is the, the first week as well that we've been training like fucking savages recently and because of how much we've had on we just we, we genuinely haven't hit all our sessions which it just happens from time to time, doesn't it? Especially when you've got a busy life. Anyway, let's go. So John was asking the question last night when we were having dinner. What is this event? Is it for clients? Is it for people that you've sold tickets to? This is one of our quarterly events. We, we have run an online coaching program, but these are a huge part of our program. It's where we get everyone together. We meet up in person and we generate a lot of fucking energy, excitement for the year ahead. Obviously, this one's at the start of the year. So the main focus, focus of this is vision. But um, with the theme of the speakers and the talks and the way that we've kind of themed the event, it's all going to come in nicely uh, to give folk a lot of essentially, it's a lot of inspiration for the start of the year. There's nothing better when you, you bring everyone together in a big room because everything's online and a lot of our clients actually do meet up. We've got clients in England, in Scotland, uh, in different parts of the world, but there's, there's no denying it. It's amazing when you get everyone together in the room. So that is the focus of today. Um, the way that we're kind of running these now, people kind of see it from the outside, they're like, you've got, a, you've got the village hotel, you've, you've got a big conference room, you're delivering talks, what's it all about? Like, this is something that a lot of people are deprived of, they, they don't have stuff like this, it's, it's not really happening much, especially in the sort of the UK fitness industry, certainly in Scotland as well, and I wanted to become more normalised for folk to actually take their, their fitness and their personal development this seriously, where... They're not just looking at that one hour in the gym, they're thinking about their mindset, they're thinking about their lifestyle, they're thinking about who they're surrounding themselves with because these are all the pieces of puzzle that really take things to the next level. So, so yeah, it's, there's some cool stuff happening, we've got some cool giveaway, giveaways, some cool prizes and we're going to be capturing the full day on content as well with uh, Drew and Kyle there as well to capture it. So yeah, please enjoy the day. Guys are here right now, Ailey with the balloons. She looks like, uh, what's that film, that horror film called? It. it. A little it look. <laughs> <laughs> Hey Charlie, what is it? What's the wee guy's name? Yeah, it's Charlie. Is it? Hey Charlie! Um, there's John there. What up? So, we're literally just at the village hotel right now. We're gonna get in, set up, but I don't think anyone's here. Usually people are mega early, but we really, we're like an hour and 10 minutes early, so we're gonna get things set up. Uh, yeah, we, got the, we got the balloons two days ago, man. They're quite sad, aren't they? This is uh, the venue around here. Hey, welcome to the bar area. Here we go. What's happening, guys? How we doing? I'm vlogging this. So I'm just gonna capture it. This is good, isn't it? I know. We're all set up. The guys are just setting up right now. We've got all the tables set. Everyone's got a wee protein bar. And uh, these are gonna be our uh, planners for when we're actually mapping out the year at the end. But the setup's dynamite. Really, really good. I'm taking Drew's job, innit? Vlogging. <laughs> Man here. What's happening? How are you feeling for today? Uh, quite good, I'm yeah. forward to it as you always. You slept in, I'm joking. <laughs> <laughs> but it's half eight now, so we're waiting on the guys coming. Um, it's, uh, the sun's starting to come up right now. It's funny, we're filming like a, a big reel of the day, like a big sort of like, we've got an advert for ready for anything. And like, we're just planning it through with Drew right now. And I'm going to have to go out in the afternoon and pretend it's the morning because it was too dark to do it this morning. So this is behind the scenes. Just waiting to get started, there's a few more folk, but we've got an absolute squad in the now. It's uh, absolutely minted in here, so much better than uh, the last one. They just keep getting better and better, so I'm very, very excited for today. Absolutely amazing turnout. Look at the fucking energy in this room. We're going to really, really, really lift it up today, guys. 
so many big announcements today, so many exciting things in the pipeline, and, and so much we just want to teach you so that you can essentially go into this year and just be nothing but absolute success. We're just surrounded by like-minded people, people that want to lift you up, be better, and this is the thing now, like what I've really began to realise. We've got people from all over the UK here, thanks for making the effort to come up, but we are denied. That is your community, which is insane. I think it's incredible anyway. We're going to ask you a question based on each of them, and you're going to stand up, turn to the person on your left or right, and discuss your answer to this question. <laughs> Drew behind the scenes. How are we, mate? Not bad, mate. I'm a good time. <laughs> really going well. Brother Drew. Brother Drew uh, comes to basically all things. Not even ready for anything, just literally Christian. Just all things Christian. <laughs> I just follow him about, have a great time, watch him do incredible things. Um, I watch him make a tent himself and all those things. But yeah. Josh is uh, currently, this is Kyle. Everyone's going through a wee exercise we've got going on right now, so basically we're asking everyone a question, just getting everyone to chat amongst each other. These are, are the seven success foundations of our programme, and uh, basically we want folk to just become more aware of them as well, so Josh, take it mate. Let's go. Go for it mate. I love how everyone just ignores Josh. They just, it takes, it takes like five shouts, doesn't it? What do you think of the day, big man? It's going well, it's going well, it's good fun. It's good, isn't it? A lot, yeah, of, uh, a lot of friendships being made. Yeah, it's good. I always had an element of energy, that dark energy, if I'm being honest, but it was always there, I just didn't have a chance. In my youth and how it's sort of um, shouting around and all of that. So we've moved every two years uh, and gradually into stability. Life, of course, like everyone, who's about what other people think about them. So we're currently just coming on to the last talk. It is my talk. We're just coming on to this big social. What's happening? It's the vlog. Um, so yeah, it's the, the last talk of the day. It's been absolutely insane. Um, every single speaker has been honestly unbelievable. Um, but I'm looking forward to really rounding this off. This last part is kind of basically kind of frameworking like my sort of 2023 biggest lessons and then helping the guys essentially map everything out going into the new year as well. Guys, we looking forward to it? Woo! Here we go. Because you're on the vlog. I get to the point now where I come off the back end of the last event and I'm like, what will I talk about the next event? And when I thought about the last one, I was thinking about athletic and performance and mowing less and mowing journey. One of the things I always think about is like, I'm just going to show how I've done what I've done and framework it in a way that you guys can walk away and take that in with the lessons that I've learned. I've been training now for over 10 years. I've been training more seriously, even more so. It's just, it keeps going. I always say for the past three years, but now it's like, now I'm like, like when did I actually start doing that? The momentum ball just keeps getting faster and faster and faster the more you go. But last year for me was a big year of athletic performance and I've been writing notes down for this for ages going that I'm so excited to deliver this. The point I'm trying to get at here, ladies and gents, is that the gap is fucking closed. Every single person in this room has the ability to do extraordinary things and I don't think enough people are aware of that and I was attempting to do these extraordinary things for years. And that is a wrap for today. Day is over. Everyone is done. The cam after the storm. <laughs> yeah. How was that team? Amazing. Yeah. Excellent. Yeah, it was unbelievable, man. Buzz. It was. Uh, it's been a long couple of days, a long week to be honest, so we're literally going to go and tidy up, then I'm going to treat us a nice dinner because it was a very wee day. Anyway, I'll, uh, I'll show you the dinner. Bye. Currently just uh, counting down the clock now. Aren't we? We're all tired. Tired after a big day, man. So we're going to uh, show one of my favourite things about anyone coming to Glasgow is I get to go to Pisano with them. And I actually like the Pisa watching somebody eat the Pisano <laughs> right, actually better than me eating the Pisano. So uh, we're going to go to Pisano, but the queue's been like an hour. So we're currently sat pushing the wind. George, it looks like we're sweating. Your head wet? <laughs> nah. Looks good. Does it glitter? It's just shiny. You just got a shiny head. You happy now? Yeah. <laughs> Best pizza ever. What an absolute spread. Sunday the 14th of January, it's the day after the event and it's been an insane weekend, an absolutely insane weekend. I said to you the other day, I, I talked some amount of shape by the way, you're going to see that in this channel. I 
I feel like I needed an extra day in this week. I'm thinking Chundy, when we just make an eighth day in the week, a chilled day, just Chundy. So, um, I like life's pretty fucking fast paced right now. It's good, it really, really is good. And, and afterwards, a, a couple of the guys were saying to me, like, how are you feeling? How are you feeling about the event? Like, it went unbelievable. And it did, it went unbelievable. But the thing with me in these events is, like, I always knew this was going to happen. I knew, I believed in the program since day one. I'm absolutely obsessed with what I do and I'm obsessed with being better and I'm obsessed with making our clients better. So like, I'm not really that surprised because I knew, I always knew from day one, um, from starting being a coach, we would we'd be doing things like this. And guess what? It's only going to get better. It's only going to get bigger and we're only going to generate more momentum as well, which is pretty exciting. And that was one of the things yesterday with the event, saying to the guys, and this is the one thing, if I can give you one thing to take away from yesterday, so many folk are living this life, this narrative where they're like, oh, like I'm maintaining, and guys, there's no such thing as maintenance, unless you are someone that's pushing really hard in one area, let's say for example, you're, you're trying to get incredibly fast, then yeah, you could say, and I'm also trying to push really hard in the gym so that I can maintain a good amount of muscle, there's no such thing as being a middle-aged person that doesn't have a lot going on, that's working a nine to five, saying I need to, I'm, I'm just trying to maintain my level of fitness. You're not growing. You're, so, and if you're not growing, you're regressing in my opinion, you're staying the same. And that's what I was saying, loads of folk in life lack purpose, they lack direction. And the easiest way to fix that is through chasing progress in every single day and every single moment. It doesn't matter what that is. And, and just get obsessed with being better. And that's, that's one of the things that we were breathing inside of the program. So I'm looking forward to actually seeing the rate of progress, people's results. And I'm also excited to hear about all the new connections we're going to meet as well for all the people that have obviously seen the event as well because I, I want us to, like, we're doing something incredible here. Nobody's doing this. Nobody's doing this to Scotland in the online coaching world. Nobody. We're making some noise here and I hope people can see that. And if you are sat in the fence looking, going, what are they up to? Just drop us a message and we'll have a chat. But some exciting announcements as well, obviously now. Ailey, who's sat here right now, typing right next to me, <laughs> is now our new Head of Athletic Performance, okay. <laughs> um, which we're absolutely buzzing about. And basically, with this, we're at the point now where we've got 80 clients in the programme, which is insane. We've got me, founder, ready for anything, and the guy that essentially oversees things and makes sure that we're getting the absolute best out of every single one of our clients. Ailey's now stepping into the role so she can solely focus on training, programme and nutrition so we can take it to new levels that... Being honest, I will, I will never be able to take it to because I'm, I've got too many things going on right now and it's having this singular focus in certain areas is going to be game changing. And then we've got Josh, who's going to be coming in full time in April is Head of Client Success and Josh is going to just be making sure that we're going to, that one of the biggest things inside of the program is that we teach our clients to do what they said they're going to do because that's the first step to building a level of trust that most folk don't have and that's what generates the momentum off the back end of it. And Josh is going to be the set of eyes that ensures that he can see every single moving part for what a client's doing and trying to achieve for their goals specific to them. Um, so yeah, it's an exciting next step for the program. I'm absolutely buzzing for it. And I hope you enjoyed the vlog to see behind the scenes because it's been an absolutely, it's been incredible. It's been unbelievable and I'm looking forward to the next one. And we're all ready. We're going to brainstorm it in tomorrow's meeting and I cannot wait for it. Anyway, catch you in a bit, guys. I hope you've enjoyed the vlog. See you later. Drop your thoughts in your comments below and please hit subscribe as well if you haven't uh, subscribed. See you later. Bye.